Hello YouTubers, this is Chaos, and this is a Let's Play video of H1Z1. So, here we go. Gotta get around here and get our bearings. Okay. We're at D2 is our position, so let's check on the map where we're at. Okay, first and foremost, we need to get some type of weapons here. Let's see what's in our inventory. And let's see, let's unbundle this. Okay, get some gauze. Okay. This doesn't look like too bad of an area to set up a little hut or something. Oh, we got set up a zombie over there. So let's gather some stuff up here. What you do is just walk through the brush like this and press E as you're going. That way you pick up some wood. Sticks, I guess, wooden sticks. Let's see what we got here. Now we're going to Discovery. Put it there. And this is how you figure out how to make stuff. Whatever it is shelter, there you go, your campfire, metal bars, planks, and all that stuff. Now, let's see. Rubbery here, I guess. You can pick up some stuff and oh my lord. Look at this. We need to get out of here quick. This is right now. Another one over there. Another one up there. This could be very, very bad. Looks like we're surrounded. Why would they spawn us in such a bad position here? quick for this. Gotta find a way out of here. And all we can do is run because we get no weapons, so. Which is why I'm trying to figure out why they'd spawn us in such a dangerous place, but it is just the way it is. and hope for the best. It's not the way you'd like to start this game, obviously. Being absolutely surrounded. More zombies. So just keep on running and hopefully we'll get away from them. There's some kind of house down here. Quite a predicament here. There's more of them. We're at D1, so we're going the wrong way. I know they're going to be close because you can hear them right on me. So there's no stop, that's for sure. All we can do is just run. There's another one down there. Another one there. Yeah, oh my lord. Yeah, this isn't going to work out well, I don't think. This is not going to look well. Helmet on, that would have been nice to have. And we're at E1. What do 
would have been nice to find a house or something we can try to escape into, but... Another one. So I guess I spoke a little too soon about a good spot to put a hut. It's obviously the one that works. Or a shack, I guess. That's what they're calling it. Okay, looks like we lost them. Wow. Excellent. I didn't think that would work, but I guess it did. So if you see yourself surrounded, you have no weapons, run. That's all I can say. And don't stop. Oh, God. Now what? I guess I shouldn't have said anything. <laughs> Not good at all. Oh well. Run to the high ground and see what see what I can see here. Seems like I pull away from them when we're up a hill. Houses, so we'll probably just run down there and hope for the best. See so if we can find something. Hopefully, there's nobody down there. You gotta watch out for other people in this game. They have a tendency to shoot first. And not say too much after that. I have played probably about a couple hours of this game so far. And then I jumped onto a new server here. I'll give you, I'll show you the game. So I was kind of shocked when they spawned me in a spot like that. Usually they don't, they usually kind of put you in a spot where you usually can get started pretty easily. There's some berries. It's always good for food. It also helps with your thirst as well. So if you're thirsty, it's good to eat these guys. They don't give you much for... Water's much, much better, but when you got nothing else, this will do. It certainly helps in a pinch, especially in one I'm in right now. So we get a house over here. It could, it could be a convenience store, I guess. A sign there. Oh, it's a trailer park. Well, this can go very well. And it can go very bad. So, let's see what we can find here. Anything on these tables or anything? Nothing. It's back here. Okay. Oh, look at that. Got ourselves an axe and a t-shirt. That we're going to shred up. That way I can make a bow. So, discovery. This is a good way of doing stuff, just like that. And there's your bow. So you make your bow. You make some arrows. And they do have better maps around the area. Usually you'll find them in these little trailers. That's where I usually found mine. Stick away here somewhere where. What is the status? And that's a 50, so. Move this down here like that. Stick up here like that. And then where's the bow? Pretty sure it made the bow. Maybe it's on the ground, maybe. 
Yeah, there it is. Sometimes they'll do that if you have no s empty slots or anything like that for anything. They'll drop it at your feet. Yeah, we use the axe at close quarters. The bow's good for a little bit of a distance. I did find a constant bow. That was nice. And it was in the cabin in the middle of the woods. Can't really take that. Ooh, I spot my little eye in a hatchet. Well, not a hatchet, but a machete. Well, we got purified water. We need this. So we'll take that. We'll take the seeds. And then we'll uh, get rid of the flashlight. Because I really don't need it. I need that more. So, let's see here. What else can we find here? Let's shut that door. You better off shutting the doors as well. When you come into a place to look around, that way you don't get surprised. And uh, just keep everything in check, I guess. I forgot to time my video, so it might run just a little bit long, and I will apologize for that. Oh, flashlight. See, so you can find flashlights all the time, so it's not like it's a... You lose your flashlight and that's it, so... I can't remember if I checked that fridge or not. Let me check it again. Yeah, I guess I did. Okay. And again, I strongly say, watch out for other players. Especially if they're in a vehicle. That's why I usually don't walk down the roads, I walk on the side of them. So that's why it's a lot easier to duck out of the way, so they don't see you. But I get killed for many of guys, or I should say players, come up, act right friendly, and then shoot you. Just to take your stuff. It's a gamble no matter what. Yeah, all cap. What's this here? Okay. Pair of glasses. Glasses and a cap. Another empty bottle. Empty bottles are great. I would say try to get at least five of them, which would be perfect. And this is how you do this. Because sometimes you can't pick up stuff. Just stand beside it press your inventory and then you can shred it up like that. This is ooh, combat knife. Hmm. This is where it becomes puzzling. Uh, always like the machete. Yeah, I'm gonna keep the machete. I'll leave the knife there. The machete you can cut down trees with. Same with the axe. And it's always nice to have the bow just for anything too long of a distance. So 308 shells, perfect. More pills, I'm gonna eat some of those. I'm gonna take that. And you can see down the corner there over here. Alright, let's see. You want scrap clothing. So you can make gauze and stuff and bandages. More ammo. It's always nice to pick up any ammo you find. Because you just don't know. You come across that gun and you realize, so oh, maybe I should have picked up that ammo. This way you don't have to worry about it. You already have it. It don't take much of a space in your inventory either, so. Always check your vehicles. This one sometimes will scrap metal in them, which you need. There's a zombie over there, so we'll check this trailer and just. And he just kind of disappeared. That was well, I'd have to check the video on that one to see where he went. And another combat knife. Let's see here. I'll try to discover. Oh yeah, I won't let me do it. So. So what's this now? Oh, berry juice. Awesome. That's how you discover things, just by putting them in here. And you can put them in different order as well. So, I don't 
no sticks or the car can tell you, it's gonna show you. But that's what that's how I discovered a lot of stuff by putting it in different like you'd have your nails here, wood here, and gauze or whatever here. And then you switch it, you'd put your wood here, nails here, gauze here, so whatever. And then you can pick up you can discover a bunch of different stuff. It doesn't always have to be in the same order. Okay. Ooh, empty bottle. Today's my lucky day, as finding bottles are concerned. I need more. Well, maybe I have enough. I'm gonna try to build. Or I should say build, discover. There we go, a satchel. Okay. Perfect. This will give me 300, so I'll take that bottle. What's this now? Can we use to create? Okay, I'll take that. And let's see here. Purified water and some salt. Here we go. Perfect. If I want to create it, go into here, and you go right there. Okay. So now I create that. There's this one here. In order to purify your water, you'd build a campfire. That's what. It's nice to have an axe or a machete, and you can chop down your trees and all that fun stuff. But anyway, I'm going to end this video here for now. And then when I start to, to actually find a place to hide and build a shelter, we'll go back there and I'll show you how to discover all that stuff. So, thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and share. And leave comments below if you see I did something wrong or whatever. I'm always up for some advice. So, thank you for watching. And hopefully we'll see you soon. Bye.